Hi guys, 18 Dap here and welcome to this episode of the FIFA 20 career mode with Doncaster Rovers Premier League, Europa League It's a busy, busy season and we want to get through it as quickly as possible because FIFA 21 is on the way um, Not sure if I'm going to get that straight away or wait for a little bit Try and get the objectives done on this one before we start FIFA 21 Not too sure yet If you missed the last episode, I'll link it in the top corner of the screen once again, thank you for voting for the goal of the episode. This is the winner. Luka Jovic. No offside as the ball was played over the top. Going for goal. There it is. First goal of the game. And coming this early, the promise of more to come. He took it on and that showed a bit of courage. But he was rewarded for his bravery with the perfect volley. Well, sometimes they can fly into those Zed, but... That one, back of the net. Well done, son. So goal A won last episode's goal of the episode. I'm very glad it did. Enjoyed scoring that. The flick from Grant over his head and the volley in. Very nice goal to score. Um, in this episode, let's have a quick look at what we're going to try and get through. Everton at home and then our first, our first trip in Europe. Um, it's FC Luzern. Not sure if that's at home or away. Let's have a quick look. I clicked to view fixture, but it is taking its time, as it sometimes does. A few moments later. Hmm. Here we go. Um, it is away. So our first European game ever is away from home. Looking forward to that. Then we have Brighton away, Liverpool at home in the Carabao Cup, we want to win that one this year, missed out in the final last season um, and then Watford at home finishes off September and then into October, probably try and get through that as well, we've got AZ, West Ham away, Norwich at home, Sparta Pra in the Europa League and then Leicester away to finish that month off potentially a cup game in there as well um, so that's planned for it this episode busy one hopefully some decent goals to show you at the end of it so let's get it underway at home to Everton
So guys, that brings us to the end of episode 2 um, of season 6. A very good episode in the Premier League and in Europe, um, but not very good for the Carabao Cup. I don't think we're going to win that in FIFA 20. Um, but we started with a 1-1 draw against Everton, a very good Everton team. And then our first game in Europe was a 2-0 win against Luzern. Then another draw in the Premier League against Brighton. Um, a bit disappointed with that, to be fair. And then another draw in the Carabao Cup against Liverpool. And for that game, it was a very good game. It played really, really well. It just didn't go in the back of the net. Um, and then we were knocked out on penalties. So out of the Carabao Cup once again. But then the anger of dropping out of the Carabao Cup was taken out on Watford with a 4-2 win. And then... The performances just kept on coming through October with a 4-2 win against AZ in the Europa League. A 1-1 draw at West Ham. Um, a late goal in that one stopped us winning that game. And then a 4-0 win against Norwich. Everything went right in that game for us. A 2-0 win against Sparta. Um, didn't really offer much resistance to, to us, Sparta, in that game. So, fairly easy win. Didn't really get out of second gear. And then a 1-1 draw against Leicester, who were top of the table. We'll check the table out now. So, a decent result away from home. And those results in this episode mean that we are unbeaten in the Premier League in the first 10 games. With 5 wins and 5 draws. And that puts us in 4th position. 20 points. 18 goals for, 7 against. It's decent. I think we're the only team to have not lost yet. Yes, we are. The only team to have not lost in the Premier League so far. Don't think we're going to be invincibles. <laughs> I think the, the defeat will come at some point. Um, but we're only three points away from top of the table. Leicester City are top. So if we beat them, could have been top. No, Everton would have been top. We'd have been one point away. So, uh, yeah, very happy with that so far. Um, Got to keep on performing because as you can see in the top corner of the screen my manager rating has dropped to 69. So we're below target and I believe that is because they're wanting us to reduce play wages by 45 grand a week. And obviously we brought in some big earners over the summer. It's not taking that into account. So if we look at the transactions and the player wages, the change this season is up £652,000. So... To reduce that by £45,000, we would have to get rid of all our star players. Rashford would have to go, Jovic, Skirinar, um, Deli Alley, all the big earners would have to go. So I'm going to risk it, try and get through the season and see if that manager rating goes up any. Um, hopefully we don't get sacked, but FIFA 21 is just around the corner. So if it does end early, it's not that bad a thing. And I think this format will suit FIFA 21 much better and we'll get through seasons a lot quicker. At the start of FIFA 20 we were doing 16, 17 episodes per season, whereas now we're down to 5 or 6. So hopefully we'll achieve the objectives in FIFA 21. I think we're going to struggle in FIFA 20. But we'll keep plugging away until FIFA 21 is here. If you've enjoyed this episode, stick a big thumbs up on it for us please. Comments in the section down below. Don't forget to vote for your goal of the episode coming up shortly. If you haven't already, please subscribe. As always, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one.
Well, it's a matter of inches. Another couple of inches either way, and it's over the bar. But it doesn't. It creeps underneath, and it's in the back of the net. Charlie.